What's up, everyone? How we all doing? What's up, young team? I am kitted up. This is some fresh ass shit, man. I just gotta give a shout out to first ever. For those of that have seen JC's posts or my story. Uh, yeah, we just got kitted up by them. So massive shout out to them. Shout out to Justin. This is really dope. I legit haven't had like fresh clothes. Oh, that's delicious. I haven't had fresh clothes in like a long time. I haven't, like, I haven't bought clothes in ages. Probably a fucking year to be honest. I've literally had the same fucking poxy wardrobe. It's been killing me. But it's been a hustle. Last time I bought clothes is probably freaking just on that salvos hustle. But I haven't, I haven't, I haven't even like got anything from the salvos in months. I've just been, yeah, wearing the same crap. So it's nice. I haven't had a hooded jumper in ages as well. I've been wearing my freaking, um, my freaking work um, jumper. So this is lit. I'm so happy with this. I actually got, I got some trackies here. I got singlet. Got a t-shirt, got some socks, and got um some shorts, so that's fucking so sick, I'm so stoked with all that, but yeah, freshly kitted now, first ever hooked up the young team, um, but yeah, what's crack a and everyone, um, just wanted to, yeah, just wanted to come on, jump on here, make some content whilst we're inside for this beautiful Friday night, doing some work and chilling out, having a drink. Um, and yeah, I just wanted to chat about the Melbourne show that we just announced, which we're all super excited for. I'm so excited for that. Um, yeah, so we just, uh, we just announced that we just, uh, yeah, we just locked that in the other week, um, which was, yeah, super cool. Uh, it was kind of, I was saying it to the boys like the other day, like I was kind of, I was getting a little bit angsty. I kind of wanted to go over east again. Um, I hate kind of being in the same spot. I love flying around. I love doing shit. I love shows as well, especially after GTM. We needed to get another show rolling just as soon as possible. Uh, so we, um, yeah, we we made the decision. We wanted to do a show on the east coast. It'd be good to get back over there, get some business done whilst we're over there. Um, and yeah, get a show for the young team. We were actually literally looking at trying to organize a tour, um, another tour for July, but it just, it just didn't like it didn't it didn't add up. Like it is so, it is a fucking task and a half. Well, it's not even more so that. Like yeah, it's a task. It's tough to organize one, but it's doable. There's nothing like crazy about that. Um, but it's more so the capital. It's more so the the cost of a tour. Uh, which is just yeah, really tough to find those uh, that capital, especially when yeah we're in hustle mode right now. So yeah, we just we couldn't organize it. So just want to apologize to the young team. I I promise you, like we're trying, we're trying as much as we can uh, for what we've got right now, for the capital we have and everything to get as many shows organized and just to try and get shit organized for across Australia. Like if we literally had it our way and we had the money, there would be a fucking tour every three months. Like we'd be, we'd have a show in Adelaide, we'd have a show in fucking Melbourne. We'd have multiple shows around between Melbourne and Sydney and then, and, you know, Newcastle and Byron. Like we'd, we'd have a tour across the entire Australia, like a 50 show tour if we could. So yeah. It's unfortunate that that isn't the case, but we're always working towards that. So for everyone that, you know, is in the other cities and stuff like that and the un old ages as well, I promise you we'll get something organized soon and hopefully by the end of the year we can have another tour organized. But for now, yep, we've got the Melbourne show. Um, it's over 18 as well, unfortunately. Man, there's not enough fucking all age venues. I'll tell you that's for sure. This is an actual issue. This is literally an issue um, in Australia, I feel like. The the lack of all-age venues with a variety of capacities is just ridiculous. Like, I even put it down to Perth. Perth's fucking all-age venues are fucking ridiculous. We have, like, legitimate venues. I can literally say there are probably, like, two off the top of my head. And one dominates them all. And that's YMCA HQ, which is quite expensive and capacity is 200 capacity is not too bad capacity is good like that's a clean venue like if there's an even smaller one as well that'd be even better but 
it's such a struggle, man. Like venue, all age venues are so hard to find. And when there are all age venues, they're usually like these large venues, you know, like the zoo and all that. Like they're, they're fucking like 500 caps and only, you can only be doing them when you're fucking already popping. So super hard to hustle and to, to come up and to provide to um, the fans um, on the come up when there's only, <clears throat> you know, you, when you're in those, those in between numbers, you know, there's not enough numbers to do 500, but there's enough to do a hundred or 150. <clears throat> so it's, yeah, it's kind of, it's a bit annoying, but in saying that, um, don't worry, we will absolutely have something organized for the all ages. Um, like we haven't forgot about everyone. We haven't forgot about the Melbourne fam. Don't you worry. So we're looking at uh, getting like a meet and greet organized or something like that, which we will. We'll get it organized. Um, we're already in contact with a few uh, different venues and whatnot and brands. So we'll have that organized. I guarantee that. Hold me to it. You can hold NGK to that, to all the all-age Melbourne um, young team. Uh, so, yeah, that'll be cool. And um, so, yeah, looking really forward to that. That's going to be super awesome. Can't wait to get back over east. Uh, can't wait to, yeah, chat some, ch- chat to some people and, and do the show, obviously. But also, the one of the things that is super exciting me is that we actually teed up the timing of this show to line up with Russ's tour. Now, Russ is an American uh, uh, artist, and he is touring through Australia. He hasn't toured through here since, what was it, early 2017, I think it was. I think it was early 2017 yeah and um yeah so he hasn't been here in a while and russ is a huge inspiration for me and has been since day one and just his 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 story his um his values his work ethic everything about him and his story and his music i just love like russ is literally my number one artist so and one of my top like inspirations so i've always said it if there aren't many artists like that I would literally buy a ticket to like no matter what like there really isn't like I'd even can like I'd even consider like not you know flying over to see Drake or whatnot if he came through here. and I fucking love Drake and I know he's the fucking king so there really there really isn't many artists like Ross is literally I said if he comes to Australia and I'm broke as fuck I'm buying a ticket no matter what like I'll go into debt to go see his show <laughs> And that's it. Like, this is a hustle. But luckily, we've, yeah, we've organized the show to, to tee up with it, which will help with everything. So, yeah, it's, it's super cool. I'm so excited for that. I really am. Like, I am, I am 100% a fan of Russ. Like, 100%. I will be fucking in there singing word for word. Like, that kind of, I listen to all his music. His catalog is enormous. One of the biggest catalogs um, any, any artist, musician has. And um, yeah, I listen to all this shit, so I'm I'm looking forward to that. It's gonna be sick. So excited for that. But yeah, it's gonna be um yeah, it's gonna be a cool few days. Can't wait to get back over east. Can't wait to yeah, meet more new young team, uh, party with the young team, meet some people, and yeah, see Russia's show and just go from there. So it's gonna be awesome. Just wanted to yeah, just wanted to chat about the show. Just wanted to chat about that whole trip. So looking forward to it. We'll get some vlogs and stuff sorted for it when we um yeah when we get there and um. Yeah, that's pretty much it. What else? Nah, that's pretty much it. Yeah. yeah. All right. <laughs> that's it for me then. <laughs> Gonna get back to the hustle. Just wanted, uh, yeah, get an episode up, chat some, uh, chat some crap. But uh, yeah, I'll probably be on tomorrow night. Whatever. Make some more content in the coming days. Uh, other than that, hope everyone has an amazing weekend. Keep hustling. Keep doing new. <clears throat> like I said. If you're in a rut, change the fucking routine, change it up, try something new, try something different, hang out with someone different, um, consume different content, just switch it up if you're not where you're at. But keep striving to be you, it's all love, it's all passion, and yeah, see you guys in the next episode.